All right, I'm here at the uh, Sinan house. Yeah, just looking at the neighbors. You got uh, a whole slew of kids down there getting ready to get the slip and slide out and have some fun, it looks like. And uh, clearly these folks have uh, kids based on the bikes and the basketball hoops and all of that. And looking at the roof here, this is a three tab shingle roof. Um, you know, looking at it, it doesn't strike me as one. Yes, you're, I guess you're getting a lot of kind of debris from the tree uh, off of it, which kind of helps make things look a little older and dingier than they probably actually are. Um, this, this roof certainly doesn't look uh, like at the end of life, but it doesn't look at the beginning of life either to me. Got brick walkway all through here. You have a crack going through here and that's just indicative of, you know, a little bit of settlement, I'm sure, right in this spot that I'm standing right now. Um, I'd be interested to really see how water is moving off that roof here and, you know, how that slope on that uh, gutter is because you certainly don't want any water coming off the front of the house here and ending up right down here. I'm thinking that's aluminum siding. You got a bird up there. Looks like God has a nest going. That's okay. like a frost proof hose bib windows have been capped you do still need to do a little bit of painting underneath the caps in these spots I might feel a little bit of bondo in there but something to scrape and paint and see where you're at Do have power out here. Looks like it's GFCI. Also, there's drainage here. It's certainly good to see. Also, you want to pop those um, grates off and make sure you have it all cleaned out, though. I see plenty of leaves down in there. And here's the carport, a really nice big carport. And that's aluminum siding. And it looks like it has been painted before. The ceiling under here could use a fresh coat of paint. 
but that's okay. And there's a little bit of a kind of a storage area for, you know, you could certainly slide a shed right in there pretty easily, um, but they have it a spot for, you know, toys and all sorts of stuff. You got privacy fence in the backyard. Nice little patio area, good for a fire pit. This deck is uh, all composite. Well, I guess not all of it is. The flat surfaces are trim could use a little bit of freshening up with some paint. Someone has redone this, uh, this gutter and you can see where it was here. And yeah, I suppose they did that when they modified the uh, modified the deck to get that around the deck and then bury that uh, that downspout. And I'm sure that corrugated pipe probably comes out here somewhere. And it does look like you have a, a gentle slope away from the house, which is good to see. This shed has certainly seen uh, better days. And it looks like there is um, some open space between, you know, your neighbor's property, just a section that really hasn't been fenced. It looks, I'm, I'm assuming that all of these fences really kind of belong to the neighbors then. It does look locked. And that compressor really matches kind of what we saw uh, on the inside. I'm sure, 2007. And that is the Sinon House.